Well, how do that, chums? As I, Captain of the Steves, and today, chums, for you guys out there in the view of us, it's just a quick cup of tea episode with Captain Steve, and it's a lovely brew this morning. Heck yes, it is. And yes, this is to do with No Man's Sky and the video that I made around there might not be a content update. Now, <clears throat> inside of that video, I started off by going over to Johnny5, the Quicksilver Synthesis Companion, and pointing out that the second item was only at 74%, and it, it seemed to have got stuck there, or 78%, it was 70-something percent. Anyway, the very next day, it was on about 83 84%, it was just about to change to 84%, I think. But they didn't. It just jumped to being freaking unlocked. So, um, yeah, I'm inside a PlayStation 5 game right now. Here's the Synthesis Companion. You can see here, we're now 4% into Tier 3. Now, I had done some sort of math. I mean, sort of, sort of, well, dirty math, I should say, to try and work out roughly when I can't interact with the bloody guy now, because this guy's in the way. Um, it's not letting me bloody... You know, for fudge's sake. The detection is too big on that guy. Okay, that's another thing that Hello Games have done now. They've made it so you can hit square on something a freaking mile away, but it, it's made it really tedious for trying to um, get into here. You know what? Let's just turn multiplayer off. <laughs> what I'm saying? The amount of times I'm turning multiplayer off now, uh, for whatever reason, whether that's to get a few extra frames or just to negate something like this. <laughs> What the actual fudge? There you go, I can now get the strip of coral. Now what I was hoping to do is get that giant sort of animal skull and stick it in front of it to make it look like a, a giant sort of skeleton. Anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, so we're now 4% into getting the next item. I mean, look at that, 4% already. And uh, it was taking a full day to get something like 2% um, for a little while on there. Now I hit on up Kurt. I hit up Kurt, the maker of the No Man's Sky app. And he can see the background sort of interactions with um, Hello Games. So I said to him, I said, Kurt, what's going on? Have they slowed these things down? This is before I made that video. And uh, yeah, here we go. Here's what I had. Here's the reply I got back. So here's what I sent him. I said, hello, buddy. Hello, Games. Been messing about with the timers on these items. They seem to be on a go slow. And he showed me this sort of graph. So that's the normal speed it would go and then you can see there it's ramped right up to being a massive amount of time and he put hey they definitely have slowed the progress down i unfortunately didn't look at when the cm was going to end when it started but this graph pretty much shows that it's slowed right down now there's also a, a little website you can go on to and you can sort of see the progress here that the kurt's put together anyway and you can see it for yourself i mean look at that oh it went on a go slow and then it I don't know, it seems to be on a go fast now or something. But anyway, people, it does look like, it says that it's now 5%, so it's about to trip over to 5%. So you know where I said it was 4%? On here, you can actually see when it's about to trip over to the 5% mark, and it's about to go to 5%. You can see at the bottom there. Here to, there you go. Boom. Pretty deep. So there we go, peeps. Um, Yeah. <clears throat> It, it definitely has been slowed down on uh, server side. So what I'm what I'm getting at, people, is now that we've managed to get this strip coral, it could be that we're back on track again. Maybe the cape is going to drop around Valentine's Day. Now maybe another four days for uh, the unlocking of item three, and then maybe it might jump jump over to the cape. And then hopefully we'll be back on track for maybe the 22nd, maybe there might be some sort of update hinging off of it. But because they had slowed the items down, my thoughts and feelings were, well, if they're slowing them down, they're doing it for a reason. They wouldn't just slow them down for no reason. It's a bit weird. Um, yeah, oddities, 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 people in the view of us. Right, I was just going to jump down to one of my bases and stick these uh, bones in the ground and see what they look like anyway, and see if we can make it look pretty gnarly with that skull. But we, we shall see anyway. But yeah, so, peeps, now what I need to be looking for, really, is the Steam database, isn't it? To see whether we're going to have well, the Steam depots, to see if we've got anything happening there. I'm just jumping over on my PC side. Sadly, I've, I've, I've set it up so it's for gaming at the moment only. Um, but I'll tell you what it. I'll tell you when they were last updated, anyhow. Steam depots. Oh, I've arrived, located over on the other screen. Yeah, put up. Let me put up the actual gaming. So at least you're watching something slightly entertaining. 
Oh, yeah. And yeah, the steam depots two months ago. There's been nothing even on the internal branch for two whole months. Right, so I'm going to stick a little dinosaur type head here. So let's go over to there. Bum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Dino head, dino head, where are you? It's I think it's in the outside items actually. Have a look, should I push it there? Well, there's, there's the rib cage that I'm going to be using. But where's the actual dino head? Dino skull, where are you? It's a shame there isn't a search option. Is it an indoor item? I wouldn't have thought so. Did I go too fast in the other one? Did I miss it? Is it in here? There it is! Fudging heck. It's near the flags. Who would have bloody fought it? Alright, um, that's a little bit small. And uh, delete. I haven't done freaking base building in eons, people. How do I make this bigger? It's not up. Okay. There you go, it's right or left. Okay, brilliant. Okay, call you! Let's stick that there then. That's as big as it goes. Ow. And now let's get those new pieces, which are not in there. They're in here. And they're just there. Sure. Oh, they are quite large, actually. Look at this. Ha ha ha! This looks quite good. Okay. I'm going to stick these. Boom. And rotate it round. Can I turn them white, though? Oh, they're already white. Okay. Go for a yellowy white, then. Yeah, that's better. That one looks almost like it might be some sort of neck joint. Which is cool. And turn these round. Hopefully make it look like a rib cage. Hmm. Okay. Probably not going to look like a rib cage, but there we are. Stick one in the middle as well. There you go. That kind of almost looks like a, a spinal cord now, doesn't it? And shoulder blades. That kind of works. Now, you could probably do a, a far nicer job than this on yours, but I think that kind of looks okay. Yeah, I think that looks kind of sweet, doesn't it? Haha! <laughs> Let's just get rid of that. Let's just go into camera mode. Let's have a better look at that. We'll put the sun in the sky. Yeah, so the red one there, that, that looks pretty evil, actually, doesn't it? Yeah. Get rid of that. Yeah, you know what? That thing, that kind of works. Haha, -ha, look at that. And you can easily make some sort of weird creature skeleton. I like that. I quite like that a lot. That works quite nicely, people in the universe, doesn't it? There we go. Isn't that awesome? Isn't that wonderful? Okay, peeps. Well, um... That's, that's pretty much all I had to say to you. Um, so yeah, the depots haven't been updated. I'm going to be watching for the signs. So I'm going to be looking for sales. I'm going to be watching the depots. And hopefully... Or even if... Um, I mean, last time it was a Twitch streamer that sort of let it leak that uh, they had been asked to cover off No Man's Sky for Twitch drops. I think we just got lucky with that one. I don't think we're going to have that sort of luck this time around. Oh, that's really cool. I like that. Anyways, there we go, peeps. Um, so, yeah, I could be wrong, is basically what I'm saying, people in the view of us. Now that the Quicksilver items have been sped back up, we're back on course, I think, for a new batch of at least Quicksilver items to come into the verse via an update. Also, there is that helmet that we haven't yet got, the solar helm that um, is inside of the game files that isn't unlocked yet, and also the Sentinel ship trails on our freighters that also haven't unlocked yet. So if you're not, if you don't know what I mean by the Sentinel sh ship trails, let me just uh, call in my uh, Sentinel ship. Where's my um, my little base computer? Let's let's save those changes to this base, people. There we are. And upload. Boom. Okay. Cool. Let's go on board our um, freighter, and I'll show you the uh, Sentinel ship trails. One second. Let me put it back over to the game for a moment. There you are. That'd help, wouldn't it? And let's go find my freighter. Where are you, freighter? Freighter, 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 where are you? Bum, 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 bum. Budget. I've lost it. I just summoned it in. Oh yeah, I'll stick it there. There's too many base markers in this region. That base that I was at, that big sen that big sort of scorpion, got featured inside of the Nexus. And then loads of people came and started building here. It was freaking awesome. Yeah, thank you, Hello Games, for featuring my scorpion. It was probably about two years ago, though. Right, oh, so I've jumped on out. Let's head on up to the freighter actual bay. Up here to the console. And I'll show you the Sentinel ship trails on the one about one of your us. So it's the one that's opposite there. This one here looks like a giant squashed armadillo. And then we're going into a base parts and upgrade. No, we're not. We're going into. I'd say we should just go back a menu. Customize appearance. 
and it's engines. Engines, you can see there, it's locked. There you are, Sentinel ship trails is locked. So I'm wondering whether that might be either a Quicksilver item that might come into the verse, or I'm wondering whether it might be some sort of expedition reward item. Now the solar helmet, I don't think I've got a picture of the solar helmet easy to reach at the moment. Um, yeah, it was a Quicksilver item. You know what? If I can find it, I will put it on the screen somewhere so you can have a look at it right now. But there we go, people. That's pretty much everything I've got for you. So I'm hoping, hoping that we might get something. But at the same time, the signs aren't really aligned. The only thing that we've got going for us right now is the Quicksilver items are back up to normal speed and they are moving at the regular pace again. Which means, hopefully, if the uh, cape is the same sort of unlock period of time that the last cape was, which turned out to be about three weeks, um, we could be looking at the end of Feb. Um, it probably will still be after the, um, the VR update. But then saying that, you know, if these things, these three items that we've got now, the strip coral and that last bit of coral, if that unlocks before the 22nd, maybe there might be a small update alongside the VR update. We can only but hope. But there we go, people. That's everything that I have. And uh, take care. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.